I'm standing by what is called the cathedra in the cathedral. So cathedra in Latin means chair, and cathedral is the church of the chair. So in every cathedral, you have what is called the cathedra or the bishop's chair. And in our theology, the chair is kind of the symbol of office and also the symbol of the teaching authority of the local bishop. So I believe Bishop Melchick commissioned this chair to be made. It's very unique. It was carved by a Polish artist in Chicago, I believe. And because of the name of our cathedral being Holy Angels, there's this angel here poised and kind of like hovering over the person sitting in the chair. At my installation, I joked that I'm deaf in my right ear. So I'm glad that the angel is on my left side so I can hear what the angel is whispering to me as I said. So this really represents the authority of the bishop, but it also speaks to the power of Christ manifest in the church. You know, that it's not about me as Don Hying, it's about uh, the leadership of the church down through the ages, uh, through the ministry of the apostles and their successors. Here is my coat of arms, and every bishop has a coat of arms. So the left side is the coat of arms of the Diocese of Gary. You have angel's wings, representing the cathedral, and incense with incense going up. And then the bars represent the steel industry of Gary. So it's a union of uh, church and the local community. The right side is my personal coat of arms. So this is an eagle representing St. John the Evangelist, my favorite gospel, an image of the Sacred Heart, a cross, and then a rose representing both the Blessed Virgin and St. Therese, to whom I have a great devotion. Every bishop has an Episcopal motto. Mine is underneath, you can see it. In Latin, it is caritas numquam exigit, which in English means love never fails. It's from uh, 1 Corinthians 13. And about 20 minutes after I found out I was named a bishop, somebody asked me, what's your Episcopal motto going to be? Without even thinking about it, I said this. And for me, love never fails says it all. That Love always triumphs, love always wins. If we give ourselves to the love of Christ, nothing can ultimately defeat us. So every time I sit here, um, I'm reminded that love never fails. I'm reminded of the presence of angels. I'm reminded of God's gift to the church, that together um, we find Jesus within this beautiful family. And what a gift it is to, to love and to serve here uh, with all of you.